Yeah. Back at it again. Uh, back at it again. Back at it again. Guy. What's up? How you guys doing? So today I'm gonna try to possibly keep this video very brief. Basically, if you haven't noticed in my last video, I brought me another one 240, which I'm going to unveil and show to y'all. This still couldn't pass up because of everything that's been done versus the previous 240. The real thing I gotta really get, which I will show y'all. No, it's not a 14. It's another 13. No, I'm not LS swapping it. I'm SR swapping it. I might even do RB. I'm thinking about putting, I put a 25, maybe a 26, or maybe just a 20. We shall see when time comes. That shit is fucking trash, dog. Get the fuck off the airway. Yes, again, no motor. No motor, I know, I know. Oh well, here goes the engine bay, which we won't be using because I have a plan for some new brake calibers. But anyway, yeah, front brake calibers are right here, but we won't be using them because yes, I have a le a nest full of wires. It's because we rewiring it, rewiring harness, and all that good stuff for some other lights. We were doing our own rewiring. Shout out to my boy Ed. For basically hooking me up, I couldn't pass this deal, and the reason why, because of these knuckles and the suspension and my funds that I had at the time, I just couldn't afford it. Yes, I have fenders. Don't say nothing about that in the comments. Yes, I have fenders. Yes, I have front bumper. I'll show y'all that in a minute. Um, he started cutting out the quarter panel. And I tell you, the reason why he was cutting out the quarter panel is because he has some XXRs on here. It was 18 by 10, and yes, they do fit. Yes, that is a massive rotor. That's a size 14 rotor. I think it's 14 in the front. I forget what it is in the back, but it's supposed to be a big rotor too. Yes, it's junky, blah, 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 and stuff is everywhere, but that's because I have to rewire some things, but some, most of the wires are finished hooking up. Not worrying about door panels, getting some street factions, these things are coming out, they're gone. Um, let's see, we got side skirts. For body kit side skirts, yes, we're keeping AC in this one. I made a mistake for the last one, took AC out, and I'm doing it in this one. Leaving it in. Um, dashboard, need a little bit of work, but I can fix that. It comes with a glove department box, so that's a good thing. Center console, that's a 350Z center console in here, but I have the original console in the inside of my garage. As you guys all know, plus the one that came with the car, I have these are the front front fenders, over flare, over flares, over flare. It's right here for the front ones. I think the rear ones, the rear ones are right there. Oh, they're somewhere inside. Of, yeah, they're right here. The rear one that's my old carpet from my other car. I kept that and gave that to him, but I'm using it in this car. Um, I'll show y'all inside. My tail lights are on the inside of the garage over there. This side was cut out too. So, basically this car just gotta be put back together. And ready to drop a motor in here. The wiring is basically done. I got wire loom that I can use. A um, bunch of 240 parts down there. Like I said, 350Z center console. 
Um, oh, and I also have the front lights, but they're different. They're not the flip up ones. So right here, we have some CTS or CTVs. I have that. I have these big massive brakes. I'm so thrilled and happy that we have these. Oh, man. So, y'all look at that and y'all might say, I guess that's what that is. I have to look that up too and tell y'all. Um, plus all the other goodies that comes with it. So this right here is my rear bumper that's going on the car, right? Sick. That came with it. This is my front bumper. Yes, I know. It needs to be work. It's not poly thing is forgot what this other bumper is that don't flex but um yeah I might be switching that out and putting this on something else different the real reason why this right here this is a subframe from an S14 we got an aftermarket all new suspension all new this is done um, solid mounts solid mount. plus we have a 350z diff plus I have these headlights so now I can finally build the car the way I wanted to build it and build a time attack the car I think I'm gonna make it time attack slash good for the streets that's my goal I'm gonna try to do something that I don't think nobody has done yet which I haven't seen on YouTube. Probably it's been done on forums, but I haven't seen it done on YouTube. But stay tuned for that. Oh, so let me show you my previous boy's work. So I don't know if you've ever seen this car, the BMW M3 in my video. He's basically ripped out the suspension. I don't know, I think he's he's basically gonna upgrade everything. Some stuff laying around, but that's because he got everything labeled for what he wanted to do for the car. The motor on the other hand, I think he's gonna keep it right now. Cause he says that he's he got some bigger plans for it. These rod burns, his rod burns, I think, went bad in here. It was starting to go bad and recorded at the right time. So he's replacing it. Um, tell you the truth, y'all, I'm very proud of him of this car because, you know, I didn't think he, I won't say he didn't know what he was doing, but I didn't think he was going to take it to this extent for him to do it by himself. The way that I know him... Back then, he would have took it to a shop, let them charge him the money, he would have just paid for it, and went on by his way. But he's trying to do things for himself right now. So, shout outs to you, Mop, part of the squad. Gang, 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 gang. I'm gonna go ahead and close up the video here. Go home, edit this blog. You guys take care. Like, comment, subscribe. Stay tuned, because we do have another one. Yes, another one. But hopefully this one will be done right. I'm not saying the last one wasn't done right. It was done right. But it just got out of hand for some of the things that need to be done to it. This one's got a way better platform. Like I said before, shout outs to you, Ed. Peace, y'all.